So what's going on? What are, what's happening? I don't know. So I was brought in today to read a letter from a student. It's a letter of gratitude. And that's really all I know. How do you feel about that? Um, I feel a little nervous. I'm afraid I'll get emotional if I read it. So I'm curious about what student would write that about me and you know how I've helped them. So I'm ready to see my letter. Dr. Newell, it's difficult to even know where to begin in expressing the impact you've had not only on my life, but particularly my daughter's through your guidance. I was originally accepted into the program in 2013, but living in a transitional shelter with a two-year-old, my own social worker told me that I needed to focus on stabilizing my life. Then all of a sudden, over half a decade had passed. I was nervous about being in my mid-30s and returning to school being a single parent with a child old enough to understand what I was doing, but not quite old enough to understand the late nights and sacrifices. You were the first advisor I've ever had to ever sit down with me and develop a plan and always found a way to help me navigate the roadblocks that sometimes I felt were impossible to move. You embodied exactly the kind of social worker I wanted to become, and you guided me through all the challenges that come with being a single parent, a full-time student, working full-time hours, and you did it all through a pandemic. But I can tell you that I look forward to work every single day. I can tell you that in January 2023, I take my license exam. And I can tell you that we are mindful of our budget, but we are no longer paycheck to paycheck. I think my car will be paid off in February after six years of struggling. And we've gone from food banks to doing our weekly grocery shopping at Publix. And I'm able now to work on my credit and begin the process of saving for a house. But most of all, because I've been able to relax and know that the important things are paid and still have enough left over not to worry, my daughter gets a version of me that is calm and playful and so much less stress than who I've been in the last several years. And I feel like what I do every day makes a legitimate difference both personally and professionally. I said the entire time that my bachelor's in social work would be life-changing for my daughter and me, and there will never be enough words to express my gratitude for all that you did to help me acquire my bachelor's and how you've changed our lives for the better. Thank you, Dr. Newell. You are a treasure. So I know who it is, for sure. Is she here? Can I see her? Okay, I'm gonna do this. Ellie, where, okay. what, are, what are you doing? Hey, Dr. Thank Newell. Thank you so much for that letter. Uh, I'm so touched. So I can't thank you enough for all that you did that. It was my pleasure to see you. And I remember every conversation you talked about in your letter and the advising through the pandemic and getting you through that last semester. So, I mean, you're the purpose of my work. So I'm so glad to see it come through and that your life is better now because you were with us. That so lets me know we did our job. Thank you. I, I really appreciate you, Dr. Noel. And we love you. I love you too. <laughs> Bye. Bye.